God. I'm sorry if I've offended your eyes with this. What the plan is. Stunning. Just so cute. <laughs> guys i hope you are all well welcome back to another vlog so today we're going to ikea because there are a few things that we need to get because my brother is redecorating his bedroom and i also have this wardrobe in my room a mirrored wardrobe and at the moment the inside i'll show you in a bit later but the inside is just not good storage at the moment because i just chose silly storage i've had it for like 10 years um so i'm going to hopefully see if i can change the inside of it and make it a little bit more functional so that's why we're going to ikea today so i thought why not vlog it because trips to ikea are always so fun aren't they like it's proper event like we're going as a whole family like it's actually a proper thing you know like you, if you know you know so yeah we're going to ikea so i thought i'd do like an ikea vlog slash uh reorganize my wardrobe with me video because i quite like to watch these and i feel i can get you in the motivated spirit to do a bit of a sort your life out in your bedroom so yeah i'm gonna take you along with me just want to show you the wardrobe in question that i'm talking about Obviously I love that I have a full length mirror, but basically if I show you the inside, the very messy, messy inside, um, you will see, oh, if it stays open, you will see that the storage is just not the best. Like, me being me, chose when I was like, oh God. Me being me, when I was really young, chose this like random, like what is that? Like a scarf hook? I mean, not you can't even hang anything because it's just so close to the thing. Like, honestly, I don't know what I was thinking. Um, and then I have these, like, random little circle drawers that might be good if you have, like, belts and things like that. But honestly, to be honest, these are just random, like, sunglasses that I don't wear. Like, it's just wasted space for me. Um, this... <sighs> I'm sorry if I've offended your eyes with this. This absolutely overflowing drawer, which needs to be sorted again. And then two actually useful drawers at the bottom. So I'm thinking I might just try and put all, pretty much all white drawers and then like a bit of shelf space. But I'm gonna see what they have. Um, but at the moment, yeah, this is just not the one. So can't wait to replace it. Whilst we're here, we'll do outfit of the day. This is what I'm wearing. I'm just wearing um, this brown top from my recent Zara haul and then this white blazer coat from Oasis and my Zara jean and oh god I keep knocking everything over not these um slippers although I wish because they're really really comfy anyway I'll catch up with you in a bit we have secured the goods I feel like every time we go on a road trip we always get a McDonald's, that's like a sign of going on a road trip, so I had to get one today. But they don't do the breakfast wraps anymore, which is literally my favourite thing. Um, so, and I, I don't understand why. Like, I know they're doing limited menu, but why? Like, why get rid of that? Like, why get rid of the best thing? Anyway, so I just got like a breakfast McMuffin and a hash brown and, of course, an OJ. So, we're ready to get on the road now and enjoy our Macadies. I did think about this, what the plan is. We have arrived and it's not even open yet. It's like half an hour till it opens and the queue is already forming. So um, hopefully we don't have to wait outside in the cold for ages. It's Christmas, Mum. <laughs> We get some sweets. I think this vase is so pretty. Like, I love the colours of it. But I have nowhere to put it, sadly. But how cute is that? Do you like it? So cute. This is the dressing space that I need in my life. Like, I wish, I wish that I had enough room in my bedroom for this because Stunning. Don't you think the most fun part of going to any bed shop is mattress testing? Oh, that one's not very comfy. Oh, these are already hard. By the way, this is literally how he sleeps. <laughs> he sleeps like that. Like the lady out of um, Freaky Friday. Tomorrow comes Give me till tomorrow comes 
So I want to try and get some vlog pictures and I've come into the car park to get some but oh my god look at the rain like it is literally it doesn't even show on camera properly but it's actually chucking it down so it's very windy in here as well but we're just gonna try and see if we can get some cool fix very quickly because uh, my family are waiting in the car so let's see but look where we have ended up again for the second time in one day i mean that's quite it's kind of shameful isn't it really but yeah. hunger you know so um i mean what else are you missing on, on a road trip like where else where else do you stop off for food burger king no no um so yeah round two mcdonald's this time got a wrap and some select and some yummy stuff so yeah gonna head home now and just being pigs basically look there's a little bird on our wing mirror and it's so cute. Come on bird. Come on. Wait, have they all gone? Wait till they return. No joke, we literally just, we just put a chip out the window and a bird just like snatched it and ate it like so, so quickly, like quicker than we could have ever imagined. Even so we, we were going to try and recreate it, but they've gone now. Hello guys, I am back from Ikea now. Looking a bit of a state because my mask just completely messed up my makeup. The wind made my hair just go a bit crazy, but let's just ignore that because I wanted to show you a very mini haul of some other things that I got. Obviously, I got the stuff for the inside of my wardrobe. Um, that's a load of drawers, and I'm gonna set that up tomorrow, so I'll show you that. But I just want to show you the little bits of pieces because you can't just go to IKEA and get one thing. Like it is a well-known fact. You just you just gotta pick up a few little things along the way. So first thing I'm gonna start with are candles. We have so many candles in IKEA and I was literally going around sniffing all of them even though I was wearing a mask but, and they just smelled so good so I literally had to leave with some of them. First one I got was like a red berries one. So it's basically like I think it's like strawberries, raspberries and I'm not sure the other one, but oh, it literally smells insane. It smells exactly like strawberries. And I know that sounds really obvious, but so many strawberry things are really artificial. And this one, oh, it just smells so stunning. So got that, that's quite a big one. Next one we got is an apple one. And I never usually get apple scented stuff, but this literally smells so good. And it's very like autumnal, I feel. I don't know, I feel like apple, I feel like, these are quite autumnal, no? I don't know. I just thought they were cute. And then the third one, this isn't actually mine, this is Josh's, but it's like my favorite scent ever. It's peach and oh, just divine. I'm not gonna open this one because it's his, but divine. Next thing I got, sort of boring, but definitely needed. It's just, well, you can't really see like this, but it's basically a big storage box that goes under your bed. Because I do have um, a load of boxes under my bed, but I feel like I can always see them and like none of them are matching. So I got two of these big white boxes and I'll show you in a second what it looks like opened up. Um, but it's kind of like fabric and I just figured that it would fit quite a lot of things in. So yeah, just a bit of a central storage. Oh, I'm actually holding it upside down. So this is the storage box. It looks very deflated right now. Basically it has two hard size and then it has a zip compartment there so you can fit a lot of stuff in. And it's quite deep, like it's pretty deep. So I think I'll be able to fit quite a lot in. Um, so yeah, I just think that'll be perfect. So I've got two of those to put under my extremely messy, messy bed. The next thing was something that I saw literally on the way out, uh, but I thought it was so cute and just really reminded me of like Pinterest Instagram pictures. So I just thought I had to get it for my room. And it's just these three vases. I don't know if you can see in the picture. I'll get them out of the box for you. It was 10 pounds for these three vases. And I think they're so, so cute. And I think that's a really good price. Um, and they just like look so good together. So that's the green one. It says yeah, it says it's yellow, but it's definitely green. Um, so that's like the biggest one. And then this one, like a little potion bottle, cute pink one. And then this blue one shaped like that. I just think those three together, I think I'm gonna put them on my bedside table. Just so cute, like, I don't know. It was a bit of a random purchase, but I like them. I mean, let me know what you think of them. I'll try and, try and insert a little cute picture of them on my bedside table here. And last but not least, this wasn't really for me. It was mainly for my sister. Um, but we got some of these dime bars uh, because you can always get them in the end. They're like 
the mini versions and yeah we got like four packets of these just because we never go to Ikea so yeah so yeah that was everything that I got from Ikea just really enjoyed browsing around and getting all the cute little trinkets so yeah but I'll show you my wardrobe interior when I set it up tomorrow since it is Halloween happy Halloween by the way um we're not actually doing anything but Josh brought over this little pumpkin so we thought we would try and carve it and just do something cute like that because well, there's nothing else to do this year is there no you've also got so, your uh... oh yeah i've got my favorite so there's already yeah. a bite taken out of it if you don't know about the snack i mean i'm sure you do but you won't <laughs> well i think it's quite normal um it's one of these like cracker breads oh it looks right it's but right it's one of these cracker breads <laughs> with uh, cream cheese, red Leicester, and then onion chutney, red onion chutney. Look, if you don't know, get to know. It is unreal. Anyway, that's not what we're here to talk about. We're here to carve pumpkins. We're just gonna get all the middle stuff out, as you do. Hopefully this knife will be okay. Let's do it. Sides are done. I'm gonna wash my hands. We and can't then, wait for me, kids. Yes. And then we will get designing. Right. We are gonna draw on the design now. Do you wanna show them the, the one we're doing? The classic. We're not being that inventive because the pumpkin's not that big. Um so we feel like we In need to reference to Alice's head. <laughs> and her head is tiny. <laughs> Tomorrow comes round again. Give me till tomorrow comes. I'm treading the water. Treading the water. Design is drawn. Let's cut. Okay, after about half an hour, actually longer than that. 20 minutes. After about 20 minutes, I was covering your head 20. So easy. <laughs> 20 minutes. Here is what we've got. I think we did pretty well with what we had. Cute. <coughs> Cute. morning everybody it is now sunday which means it is time to put up the furniture that we got from ikea which is very very exciting however that does mean that i have to start by emptying all of the crap out of my wardrobe which is not gonna be a quick task uh, just to refresh your memory of how it looks right now this is all of the rubbish I have in my wardrobe that needs to be sorted out. So good luck to me, gonna start off by doing that and make sure it's all clear so we can finally put together the drawers and the shelves and just make everything a lot more organized.
Good morning guys, it is the next day and the wardrobe is all done and dusted. I was actually going to show you it yesterday but we actually just got a bit sidetracked and started making pancakes halfway through and then it was too dark so I thought I'd just wait until today to show you the finished product. So here is the big reveal. So this is what the wardrobe looked like before, it was just an absolute mess, too much in there, just awful awful storage and this is what it looks like now so 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 much clearer the storage is just so much better now that i have all of these drawers the drawers we got actually don't match the bottom drawers but i don't really mind you know it doesn't really bother me they're the same size and everything so now we have a main shelf which just has a bas couple of baskets with hair things, skin things, makeup brushes and then that box just has some palettes I don't really use and that box has some extra products I don't use etc etc so a few useful shelves and then I have all my hair utensils in this drawer this one has like jeans and trousers in then we have socks underwear and extra tops so yeah I just think it looks so so much better and it's just so so much clearer I feel like I can breathe again and compared to what it was it is just miles 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 better so I'm very very happy with how that turned out Thank you so so much for tuning into this vlog and for watching until the end. If you did enjoy it then pretty please give it a thumbs up and maybe even subscribe to my channel so you can join my YouTube family. I hope you have a fabulous week and hopefully I will see you in my next video. Bye!